morning. I'm here at Little Qualicum Falls and it's time for some light language for the Lionsgate portal. I'd love to hear what this brings up for you. I'm not going to share the messaging. Um, the, uh, as I'm saying it or at the end I'm not going to share the theme I want to see yeah I'd love to hear what it evokes within you what sensations it brings what images it brings um, enjoy ちょっとこう。いや、ここがちゃっとだ、ちゃっとだ、ちょっとこう、うのとどっちだ、ちだ、ちきいだな、うなや、ちゃっとこう、ま、あや、しとも、したいちゃ。はや、はや、うんな。
Oh, it's a little bit of 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 a little bit i come into this life with one purpose. And that is to be you, Titano Tsuki. Be you. Don't know who you are, Tatsitatanama. Don't remember that frequency that makes you just feel strong, compassionate, present in self. It's okay, it's not uncommon. The forgetting is the part of the process for so many people. So many people. But if you're ready to remember, you feel that something's not quite right in your life. You feel disconnected from yourself in a way that is you find yourself doing things that you're like, why am I doing this? And it comes up so many times that you're just like, why am I doing this? You know, it's time to remember. It's not an easy process. At least I should say, it didn't know the but it's okay. It can not be an easy process for many because of all the changes that happen and the new that you're getting used to and the boundaries that you're learning and putting in place and the lifestyle that changes it can be uncomfortable. But when you get to the other side, there's more comfort. The discomfort is less. The challenges are still there. I'm not going to tell you there aren't any challenges. Because there are, but they're different. You have different tools. And when you're there as self, not as other, or not as trying to present self for other people in particular, that is what brings in the sense of ease and the flow, even in challenge point. Because you are in center point, which is you. Your original frequency, your original source code. And that's what you're here for. Even when we feel less than, and what am I even doing? And the me that is here when I show up as the pure me, is a burden, is cumbersome, isn't actually doing anything, isn't doing something grandiose. That's not the point. The point isn't to do something grandiose. Some people do things that you might find grandiose. What you do on a daily basis to somebody else might be like, oh, they do that? That's amazing. But for you, you're like, I'm just being me. I'm going through my day. For some people, it, even if you get up every day, go to your job, you know, do all the things that you normally do, get groceries, come home, take care of the family, for somebody else, that might be a big deal. But by showing up as you and by doing the things and continuing to be present to your space of your life can inspire somebody else to show up for theirs to begin to remember their original source code, to know that they're not required to just do as is. To not 
follow the status quo if it doesn't feel like it's nourishing for them. If it doesn't feel like them. Because there's no one pattern. There's no one cookie cutter. There's no one way of being. How are you being? How is your being? Right? And if there's a lot of static and you're not actually sure where to start, come here, come to nature, turn off the hum of the electronics, which I get, I'm recording this with an electronic, um, but to record, to not record, to come to nature, to turn off the hum, to reduce the hum of electronics in general, EMF, all of that, Reduce all of that. So when you come into nature, no music, none of that. Put your phone on airplane mode. Turn off all the hum so that all you're hearing is the frequency of nature. All you're feeling is this. It might take a couple of days. It usually takes a couple of days. And that's where the silence, the stillness happens and you're able to hear the hum of yourself. You're able to hear the rhythm of yourself. So I encourage you to do so. I'm gonna show you the river. Yeah? Ooh, see her? This is just a small piece of her. She's magic. The Qualcomm River, the Qualcomm Falls. Pure, utter magic. Yeah. Okay, feels like one of those transmissions that could just go on and on and on, but I'm going to end this one here, okay? Sending you so much love and stardust. You got this, 100%. And I'm so excited to see you as you are. Yeah, okay. Bye, man.